All right, we are at Jerome Cemetery in Indiana. Just taking a quick little roundabout here. Say hello, Krista. Hi. Looks like an old part of the cemetery down here, so I'm going to walk down here and see what's up. Everyone says this is a, a scary cemetery. It's supposed to be haunted. I don't know. You tell me. I might get kind of quiet. Sorry. Sorry about that. I'm just kind of looking. I don't want to step somewhere I'm not supposed to. Oh, the ground is extra, extra soft, though. Take a step and you sink. Going back into the old part of the cemetery. Some of the some of the stones though they don't look too healthy. Some of them's laying over and kind of broke a little bit. And I hope I'm not trespassing on anybody's land or anything to try to get back here. It's a cool day. Leaves are all over. I'm sure you can hear me crunching them. But I don't, I don't feel like this is a bad place. You know how sometimes you can feel like the hair is standing up on the back of your neck or something like that. I don't, I'm not getting anything like that at all. It is interesting though. They're supposed to be in the center, uh, in the newer part, like a little pentagram type thing. But I haven't found it yet. I'll keep looking for it. And uh, just do a quick, quick walk through. Some of the graves back here just look like they've been forgotten, which is very, very sad. It looks like they go off into the woods, too. That's kind of weird. wonder how far they go because there's a big ditch over there. Oh, things are laying over on top of each other. So I guess they have kind of been forgotten. I don't know. I guess what I'll do is try to pause my video here and uh, I'll go around and do a walk through and go on up to the newer side and see if I can find anything up there. Hello, it's Christy with Hot Flashes. I want to show you this. It's it's hanging rock, okay, in, in Wabash, Indiana. And I haven't got all the way up there to the top yet. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to get all the way up there to the top. I'm going to try. And I want you to see a little bit about it. I'll take a history shot of all the stuff when I go down the hill. Sorry, I didn't take it for I come up the hill. But I'm trying and I'm climbing. Alrighty. I'm going to pause it here, pack up, and try to get up a little bit further. This is a different view of it. Okay. And I don't think I'm going to be able to get up there right now, especially with all the backpacks and stuff that I got. And I left the other half of hot flashes down down there on the highway <laughs> all right I'm gonna pause it there and see if I can make my way down in one piece all right this is the information on the hanging rock hope you can see it because my lighting on this thing's not too good right this second on this tablet so that's where I was just up there I didn't get all the way to the top but I give it a shot I get better equipment and I will. This is the Wabash River 
information on it. Somebody just pulled it up, so might as well do a fast video of it. And I'll close it up. That's cool. We're in an antique mall in Wabash, Indiana. I don't think I'm allowed to have a phone in here. But I just want to give you all a little bit of idea of what I'm out doing today. I'm going to pause it so I don't get caught. That's a freaky photo. <laughs> I said that's a freaky photo, and you're like, what a beautiful piece. <gasps> Creepy baby picture. <laughs> yeah, that is a beautiful piece. Anybody want to make a telephone call? It's a slot cigar mold. Oh, yeah? I don't know nothing I'm about it. I'm open it now. That's what it says it is. I'm not narrating. I'm just filming. Oh, yeah. That is pretty cool. Interesting oh, Look, the windows. That's pretty cool. Well, this is his chuck full of antiques and stuff. And We are still in Wabash, okay? And down uh, around the corner is Modoc's Cafe. Mm -hmm. And there's a whole history about Modoc. So I'm going to try to get down there and film a little bit. It's got elephants that go all the way around it. And when I post this, I'll try to put some of the history up with it. Um... It's really pretty downtown Wabash. You can go from shop to shop, just walk around. What I'm going to do now is kind of pause you right now until I get to the elephants. All right, I'm going to cross the street now. Starts with the pictures of the elephants and stuff, or of Modoc. I'm pretty sure everyone probably knows the story and the history of them. And it was in this town that he kind of went crazy. So they kind of pay tribute to him. They got a whole cafe dedicated to him, but I don't know if they're gonna let me go in and film, so I'll just kind of walk by and film the windows. <laughs> they're very proud of Modoc. Oh, see elephants go here all the way around their store. And it's very, very neat. They have the history of him. There you go. On November 11, 1942. So that wasn't, you know, that wasn't just yesterday. But they got the history. And like I said, it's downtown Wabash in Indiana. And there's shop after shop, and they're adding more shops. So if you're ever bored, Come on down to Wabash, Indiana. You can go to the picture show. Someone just saw Gone with the Wind. And they just recently um, was awarded um, Best Tourist Town, either in Indiana or in the United States. I can't remember which, and they were awarded quite a bit of money. So it's going to be building. So if you're going to be coming here soon, probably a good idea to stop in. And we haven't even filmed all the way around the block. This we is the Welcome Center. Oh, okay. It's all it's all actually pretty cool. Yeah, it's very nice. You know, bring your family out. You can, I mean, there's restaurants, places you can just sit down and, like I said, go to the movies. This is one that's in, under construction. And this is just, like, right around one building. We didn't even go down all the city blocks and all that stuff. 
you could probably spend a good afternoon here. They do have um, uh, what is the antique store? And you said the other one was like a name brand antique yeah, store. Yeah, delicious, and, and the, the antique store we just went into, we just showed you the inside of. So I'm gonna I'm yeah, gonna pause yeah. it here, and we're gonna make our way back to the car.